Nevada's first choice for news. This is 8 News Now. If Making connections. The new, the new technology helping a struggling school learn from students around the world. Hundreds of kids at one Clark County school got a gift that no other K-12 school in Nevada has, a one gigabit fiber optic internet connection. And that means a video that normally takes three minutes to download now takes just seconds. Sounds great, but how does that boost student achievements in the classroom? Well, Cherie Harvin is here to explain that, Cherie. Dave, educators say it's all about engaging students in learning. That's what's important. And a majority of students there are minorities. And in some grades, just 45% of students are proficient in core subjects like math and reading. Now the Academy is the first one gig school in Nevada connecting students to the world. Launch all three videos. When it comes to inquiring minds. I think that's going to be really cool. And the iPads are streaming. The faster the internet, the better. I think it can help the fashion line, help me get the clothes that I actually want. Surfing the web unlocks a Pandora's box, but this free high-speed gift from Cox Communications won't be used for what kids want, like games or music, but rather what they need at the 100 Academy of Excellence, where Peggy Selma is principal. We want them to have access to the world, and they need to be able to know that there are other people in all parts of the world that are doing things that are similar to what they're doing. Selma wants students to video conference with kids in other countries. The new fiber optic service will also help administer online testing. Plus, students can access math and reading software programs without losing internet service like now when too many classes are online. It's a gift Clark County Schools Director of Charter Schools, Dan Tafoya, hopes to bring to more students who don't have the opportunity. All communities, but especially for our communities that may be considered at risk, it's important to be able to put that technology at their hands. Hey, hello, Ms. Williams. Good morning. And just as fast as the service, students are already more engaged in education. We get to learn more things about it and get to meet new people around the world. Gotta meet people around the world, right? Well, the 100 Black Men Organization and Imagine Schools in Virginia opened this charter school in 2006. And CCSD Charter School Director says more nonprofits should team up with businesses to make a difference in students' lives. Days. Thanks, Sheree.